How do autonomous trucks handle different and challenging weather conditions? It is a question I get asked uh, a lot, also by family and friends, but then of course also people uh, joining the team. I find it super fascinating because the the way the truck perceives the world and how it reacts, that's maybe the part of the system that's easiest for people to, uh, to have an intuitive understanding because I sometimes struggle when it's raining or, uh, or snow outside. For autonomous driving, the thing that makes them much stronger than humans is that you can equip them with a number of very different sensors. We have our eyes, our ears as our main sensors. Um, for autonomous trucking, you can leverage LIDARs where you shoot out laser beams and check how long they take to come back. You have radars which can directly tell you how fast something is moving towards you or away from you. We can have cameras, but also infrared cameras that can even detect heat signatures of vehicles, of people. You often build um, the sensor set so that it's complementing each other. So the strength of one sensor is combined with the strength of another sensor. And when you know that one sensor struggles more with fog or with rain, then you bring in another sensor, for example, a radar, which might be less sensitive to these things. Figuring out through intelligence on board whether your system is in fully functioning mode or whether there's a, a deterioration that you need to take care of, either by cleaning the sensor or by adapting your driving, or worst case, just stopping. All of that is part of how autonomous trucks deal uh, with adverse weather conditions.